Africa's myths and legends have been told in many ways. Tales of great battles won and lost to the heroes who paved the way for freedom. We'll show you one of them which took place at the Moose on stage on this week's edition of At House to an exhibition by a contemporary artist who is revealing a colorful festival which is staged in the Zuru local government area of Kebi State. That's just part of what to look forward to on today's edition of At House. Great to have you join us. I'm Melinda Akinwami. An artist has only his dreams. He has no power. We fall all casualties of the war because we cannot hear each other speak, because eyes have ceased to see the face from the crowd. It's a musical production on Africa's icons and cultures, directed and produced by Benga Yusuf and Ayo Ajayi. It's titled Legends, Kings and Kingdoms. Traditional stories of five legendary African icons from Nigeria, South Africa, Egypt and Ghana, told at the mission stage. It's a musical play about their lives and triumphs, and it's told in music, dance and dialogue. The, 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 the real intriguing part of it is about is the entire play itself, because this is a play that is treating the past the present and the future of, to me, the black man, the African. And he's treating it in a, 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 so a creative, uniquely creative way to spotlight the mistakes we have made in the past and the real permanent solution to our problems. You knew about this, didn't you? Shaga, it is not important. You, mother, my bride, everyone knew. We were trying to protect you. Protect me from what? Protect you from what you are trying to do. I'm sorry, father, that this marriage will have to wait. Shaga, it took me 3,000 years to convince her. There is no need. I'm such a lover of history, and I think that it should be done, you know, if you're doing history, do it well. And there are so many people in our generation who don't know about their culture, and I think that it helps people go and research. And with people, man, <laughs> I'm fit. <laughs> I know, I go to the gym and all, but I thought it was going to be a piece of cake now. Ah, it's not, I mean, I just throw leg, throw hand. <laughs> but when I came here, I saw that. <laughs> man, but with the help of people around, crew, cast members holding my hand, I was able to pull through. And I think that people should look forward to not just aesthetics, but the feeling, how it makes them feel, uh, there's so much humor and so much you know, going around. So when they leave, they, they need the values to actually go with. It's not about, oh, having a good time and laughing. It's about going to show love to your neighbor. The central theme is love. You got a second chance on a platter of gold, and yet you choose to throw it away all because of Motorland. I... But Motorland will not change. Motorland will destroy you. I call off this wedding and I leave you to your fate. Let your thirst for blood overcome you. Shaga! You make me a laughing stock. A man, a father, a king who couldn't give his son a wife in life and in afterlife. Let him go to wife! Bele, Ubal Kaba, Wambe, I forbid you to go. You want me to remain here while Motherland runs? I'm sorry, Father, but this is my destiny. This is who I am. The prophecy will be fulfilled all over again. Five African heroes who lived at different time periods in history. Shongo, Nanaya Asantewa, Nefertiti, 
Shaka Zulu and Queen Amina of Zao Zao are summoned from Kumboya by the little priestess who lives in modern time to come and save the motherland from the destructive grip of the shadow. Did it not make your heart beat fast? Did it not make you thirst for war? No. Out. Out! Oh yeah, I was having a massage. I can see that. What I cannot see is the man I fell in love with. The Shongo, I know. And which Shongo do you know? He's walking. The Shongo whose heart cannot stand injustice, whose eyes cannot behold, see the earth tremble, women and children in chains. I'm playing the role of Shongo, which is a huge honor for me to play the role of Shongo, a legendary king. You know, um, it wasn't crazily difficult. Um, I'm not sure if, I mean, it's obvious that I can't fit into the, you know, into the picture of the real Shango, but from the history, from what I've heard about him, um, it was a question of how do I get into this character and become this character, and without some of his major attributes like his anger, like his, um, like his strength, and all of those things. So this Shango decided not to fight. The whole must remind you of who you are, Shango, son of thunder. Rise up to your duty and become who you really are. Boburu, all you want to be Baba, he can't want to leave. If I must go, then you shall have to come with me. This is your moment of glory. Uh, it is yours and yours as well. What if my anger finds me again? Oh, yeah. But they realize that the shadow is the greatest the enemy of mankind and can only be destroyed by silencing humanity's extravagant lifestyle. Take me to the shadow. Wait, what? What shadow? Do not tell me she's coming with me too. Shaka Motherland needs all the help it can get. Never! Shaka does not fight alongside a woman. Why? Because she does not know what it means to be a man. <laughs> she cannot wear the isikoko, the head ring of manhood. I lay siege on the white man and his guns and only forced him to surrender. Ah, a woman. You are no match. What? So you think yourself my equal then, huh? <laughs> I can defeat you and your ugly crown. You okay. will be destroyed by the full force of the Zulu. I am your Asantua. I fear no man. Ha! Ah, you have insulted my Isikoku. And I shall show you no mercy. No, 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 no. <laughs> When we started Binga and High, we had a picture in mind. We wanted the best cast possible. And then, you know, if you can actually view it, you can achieve it. So one thing that we did was, okay, there is a picture for Chaka in our minds. There is a picture for Amina. There is a picture for Nefertiti. The only thing we need to do was to look for people who fit this bill. And then from the show, everybody can testify that, yes, we've, we've done a good job with casting. When her eyes first saw through me, for a moment, for a moment, I thought, huh, I was found out. Ah, stop fooling around or I shall twist your arm. You do not know whom you speak to, woman. Uh, 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 I was waiting for the song. I was waiting for the song of the priestess. It feels so good to be back. In staging this play, all the elements of drama were put into consideration. Legends, Kings and Kingdoms is a musical production directed by Benga Yusuf.